like that first question for you. <laughs> Tell me how did the first rehearsal go? Um, I think it was good. Uh, I mean, we have a lot of things that we're going to change, but uh, it was very productive and the crew, the team is very collaborative. So I think that it's all going to work out. I can only imagine how a brainstorm would go where you come up with the flowers and the, the ball that goes in the air. And uh, Were you uh, a part of that? Yes, definitely. Um, I mean, I, I definitely have input in anything I do, uh, art, you know, artistically. But um, you know, there were ideas, and it, it's been a collaboration with the team. Yeah. Okay. Um, I also want to compliment you on your on your outfit right Thank now. You. Is it is it a, a Greece designer, yes. Greek designer? The uh, Zom, and so is my costume on stage. The Zom. I love them. They're wonderful. Right. Et uh, j'adore le Belgique aussi. Uh, yeah, you're from Belgium, right? Yeah. Okay. So we're from the uh, Flemish-speaking oh, part, okay. the Dutch-speaking part. <laughs> okay. oh, sorry. No problem. Um, so um, you lived in uh, Canada for, uh, for the the for the first majority. 16 years of my life. Yes. Yeah. Do you think uh, Canada should be in Eurovision as well? Yes, I think it would be. Incredible. I would really love to see Eurovision go global. So hopefully that will happen one day. Now a lot of artists that uh, perform in Eurovision, they don't know a lot about the contest, but I heard that you do. Oh, depending. Uh, I know a few things. But you're a, a, you're a fan of the, of the first hour, no? Of the first? Sorry? You are a, a long-time fan of Eurovision, no? Yes, yes, yes. I, I've been watching Eurovision, yes, for quite a few years now. You want to test me? <laughs> no? No, just tell me about your favorite uh, song. Um, my favorite, I think, is Salvador Sobral. Recent. So you uh, voted for him? Uh, yes, but uh, also ABBA. I love, and I also like Sebastien Tellier a lot. Um, and who else have I really liked? I've liked so many. Um, and I, I, I really like, like the, the old, really old performances, like in the 70s. I just love that aesthetic. So yeah, a bunch of great acts, definitely, and uh, wonderful artists that we, that, you know, that have been, uh, that we've gotten to know because of Eurovision. And how is, is uh, Tel Aviv for you? How is Israel treating you here? Uh, I mean, great. We have. I haven't seen anything. Uh, we came last night, and today was our rehearsal. So all I've been doing is rehearsing and, and press. But uh, um, I think that it's just so important to have a very collaborative crew. The uh, the production here is just highly professional. So I'm I'm feeling really good about it. And can you tell me about your favorite act this year? I have a lot of favorites this year. I think it's, um, for me, it's my favorite year in a very long time. I think that it's such um, a relevant year, very current music. And I practically have a different favorite song every week. Uh, I really like Italy's and Netherlands and Slovenia. I like Portugal. I like Czech Republic. Uh, yeah, quite a few. Now, your song is, is very different from the song that uh, Greece brought us last year. Um, can you tell me about the, the meaning of the song, the message that you want to bring across? For me, it's about believing that you deserve more, you know, that you deserve better. You, and I think that once you establish that better love in your life, you know, by not following any conventional paths or what other people want from you, uh, expect from you, just following uh, who you are, being true to yourself, listening to your needs. I think for me, that's the definition of a better love for yourself first and foremost. And, you know, once you have that, I think you can establish it in your relationships with other people. And, you know, for me, that's the key to a better world, really. Well, your song is definitely unconventional, the act as well. So we're looking forward to see Thank you very much. the next uh, rehearsal. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you so much.